I've been exposed. <gasps> what? Nani? Oh! Deviated fish has caught me with my pants off. So recently I uploaded a video by the name of me saying Mr. Beast 6,000 times. But what I didn't know is that someone was going to count them all. <gasps> You're kidding me. That's right. Someone took their sweet time to count every single time I said Mr. Beast. Or Mr. Meast. Or Mr. Beats. Little did I know this was gonna happen. Recently, a YouTube channel by the name of Deviated Fish has uploaded a video called Exposing Slicko Nick Plus Interview. We'll talk about that a little later. So that's right, someone decided to count every single time I said Mr. Beast. I in fact did not say Mr. Beast 6,000 times. How many times did I say it? Well, you'll find out later in this video. So without further ado, let's show you what Deviated Fish is talking about. The video starts like this. Yes, I have indeed made that video, saying Mr. Beast 6,000 times. Oh no! Did I really say Mr. Beast 6,000 times? Or was he faking it for the views? Let's find out. As they say on my favorite TV show, <laughs> The rules are simple. Basically, they gave themselves some rules of what to count and what not to count. The rules are this. I will count any Mr. Beast during the challenge, plus the extras, and the Miss sayings. So they even counted the times I said Mr. Meast, Mr. Beats, which it sounds slightly off, but I mean, if you're saying the same thing a thousand times, you'll eventually s start slurring it all up. Is that the right, what am I saying? They also won't count any Mr. Beast before and after the challenge, the reaction to how badly I said Mr. Beast, and extra stuttering without saying the full thing. I think we know how the rules are gonna go. Let's find out how many times I really said Mr. Beast. One last thing. This may not be 100% accurate. It was midnight and I was sick at the time during this recording. Otherwise, enjoy the video. He then proceeded to count every single time I said Mr. Beast in a very painful, torturous manner, which is probably my fault considering I created the video. And to give you some sort of clarification in your little noggin right there, that video is over an hour long. I'm not kidding, that's how long the challenge took. Did I really say it 6,000 times, or did I not? Well, apparently I didn't say Mr. Beast 6,000 times, I said Mr. Beast 6,124 times. <laughs> Booyah! I suffered with the challenge more than I should have because I said Mr. Beast more times than I should have. You signed up for 6,000, but too bad you get extra of my suffering. So I guess he actually said it 6,000 times. I wasn't expecting this. I was so pumped to expose him. I could have saved hours of my life just letting this be and not trying to expose him. The least I could do now is go interview him. You use Discord light mode? <gasps> Nanny, what? <sighs> you use Discord light mode? Pathetic. <laughs> that was a stupid skit. The remaining 10 minutes of the video is just really the interview. Like, it's all sped up, but it's gonna take a long time to watch through it all. I'll only mention the highlights. I honestly didn't know this was all gonna be recorded, but it doesn't matter. I'll just point out all the interesting parts about this interview. The first question is, how was it like to do the Mr. B6000 challenge? And I was honest, I did say it was very long, boring, and painful. The ending was just something magical. That feeling of achievement, well worth it in the end. Deviated Fish asks if I'm gonna do another challenge like this again, and I was like, mm, maybe, sure. They in fact gave me an idea to do another one of these challenges where I would say my name 6,000 times, but then it gave me the idea of saying my name 6,969 times, because aha, funny number. Well, two funny numbers. If you see a video that's over an hour long and it's just me saying my own name, 
that many times, well, you know where I got the idea from. Ask what my favourite movie is, I say Zootopia because that's, you know, obvious. That's why my YouTube name is Slicko Nick. There's a bit of the interview here that I'm just going to skip all of, but if you want to see the whole interview, then go to their video. It should be in the description or up here in the cards. One of these sides. Cards, are you there? If I forgot to add you, then this is very, uh, embarrassing. They then decided to give me the guessing game where I have to guess how many times I actually said Mr. Beast. After a little while of guessing and getting completely wrong, I finally guessed it and it was all good. I then begin to start talking about the history of Mr. Beast, aka my next upcoming project that I'm really taking my sweet time to do. Don't worry, it'll come out this month. I mentioned it in the video that it was going to come out sometime in September, so just be patient. I mentioned how the video is going to be in 4K at 60 frames per second for that mwah quality. I also don't know how long the video is going to be yet, if it's going to be like 20 minutes long, less or more. I'm not too sure yet, but we'll see. We'll see. Now there was a point in time where the interview was going to end, but I decided to keep talking about something else. Which would be the random question of the week with number 100, aka maybe the last episode. The interview eventually ends, I wave to the camera, and then it was all good night everyone, have a great rest of your day. Or night. And of course Deviated Fish had to make the outro the good old Mr. Beast style. And then the last couple of seconds is just, just showing the computers again, and we think, aww, it's adorable. So the video ends with showing this cat on the computers, and it's just, aww, it's adorable. Mr. Beast is yeah, you know his name. He changed it once or twice, but I think it's here to stay. So yeah, if you want to see the whole video, again, check in the description, or I probably showed you the cards already, so it won't probably let me do it again. But also, yeah. I'm so terrible at making videos. <laughs> Ugh. In case you aren't aware, yeah, Deviated Fish is a really good friend of mine, we talk on Discord a lot, and if you want to check that YouTube channel out, it'll be right here, and you can check my Mr. Beast 6000 video here, and if I could share their video as well, I'll put it right here, and so yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Also, Deviated Fish, if you make a response video to this response video to your exposed video, then do do that. Definitely do that. That would be very interesting to watch. See you next time.